Welcome to What Away with Washers, where we tried to model a washer as many ways as possible using Creo Parametric. Let's start with the simplest way, and we'll make a sketch on the top plane. Two circles. Thanks to Creo 9, when we change one dimension, both of them update. For this exercise, my washers will all be an outer diameter of 2, an inner diameter of 1, and a thickness of 0.5. So a sketch of both the inside and outside diameter and an extrude thickness is one opportunity to make a washer. The next step to make a washer will be two different extrudes to achieve the same geometry. Start with an external extrude. And create another extrude. To remove the material. Removing the material can be done through several ways. I don't recommend typing the value in. Other options include through all, through to next, or an interesting version is using shift and drag to select the bottom surface. Remove material should be selected. Our third extrude option exists where we already have a blank material. This bar has the same thickness that we want for the washer. My sketch here already has the 1 inch and 2 inch diameters that I'm looking for. I can use the sketch and extrude. This is going all the way through, but instead of removing material inside the sketch, if we remove material outside the sketch, we are left with a washer shape. The last option for just extruding a washer shape is sketching the outer diameter. And in the extrude options, we'll thicken sketch. So the wall thickness of this washer is 0.5. Again, the depth is 0.5. We can give it a diameter on the outside of two inches with a half inch wall thickness and a half inch depth. Or we can give the inner sketch a diameter of one inch for the inside diameter. And in the extrude, flip the material on the thicken to the outside. Another extrude option that's not very obvious is to create half the geometry and mirror it. You could use a circle and trim, but we'll use the arc tool just to cover that. We can type in math, such as 1 divided by 2, or we can convert this to a full diameter and type in that value. Extrude at 0.5. So far we've only gone above the top plane, but just to show you, we could also have made that a symmetric option. The mirror tool uses the extrude and we can mirror it over a plane. Join us on the next What Away With Washers to see all the different ways we can include revolves.